hi guys welcome back to my channel in today's video I will be showing you on how you can create the easiest Dollar Tree centerpiece yet you're just going to need just a couple of items that you can get from Dollar Tree I am going to be dressing it up with some crystals if you've been watching my channel you know I love to incorporate crystals in my DIY projects so I definitely highly recommend that you definitely use crystals for this project so stay tuned and watch how I put it together you're going to need six Dollar Tree candlesticks and you're definitely going to need your Gorilla Glue and you're going to need two glass cutting board I believe they measure about eight inches in diameter you're also going to need this beautiful crystal and then you're also going to need this beautiful um, pendant round prism pendant I believe they are called we're gonna go ahead and use our second glass cutting board to add our crystal hanging garlands you want to leave at least about half an inch in between each garland I did not measure how many inches in between each strand that I wanted to leave I just kind of used my judgment on the spacing in between each garland so if you want to measure you can however you are free to use your judgment and kind of use the eye test and separating the garlands to make sure that you have them evenly um, split apart from each other. My glass cutting board is eight inches in diameter. It took 22 hanging garlands. And then from the 22 hanging garlands, I just count backwards so I can get from longest to shortest. Okay. So 27, 27 beads that I have for my very first garland. And then I add this diamond piece you see at the end. Now, my second garland has 26. So for each garland that I add, I take out a garland. So basically you're counting backwards until you get to your 22nd hanging garland. So this garland has 27, the second garland has 26, and then I add my diamond piece at the end. The next garland has 25, 24, 23, 22, 21, 20, 19. So you get the gif, okay? So basically you're counting backwards until you get to your final garland at the top. So that's how you are going to get this beautiful illusion that you see here with my crystal hanging garland. And I absolutely love, love, love how it came out okay so definitely you can add any pendants you would like towards the end so definitely comment below and let me know what you guys think
also guys thank you so much for supporting my channel and for always always being here to you know compliment my work i really truly appreciate you guys you guys are amazing i really hope that this channel can help stay tuned for my next video bye guys